In this video, we're going to learn how to insert um, charts into Excel. So we just make a chart up here. Um, this is the information again, the global mean sea levels data sheet. So if to insert a chart, I basically to say this is the data that I want to put in. So that's the, so if I go to year, click on there, and you see it's a continuous lot of data right down to line 131 and two columns here. So I'm going to go up to the insert option in the ribbon here I've got the menu ribbon and I can say recommend a charts and it will see that it will basically in, um, make a chart up from the entire block of uh, data here and I can choose whichever chart that I think is best so I think that one's pretty good it shows the actual level as well as the possible variance that occurs within that so I'm going to go OK and now I have inserted a chart into here but there's some more you can do for example if I didn't want to have the um, the variance and the uncertainty I could go over to here and just choose holding um, shift and click and just select two columns and again if I go insert and recommend a chart and you'll see that it's just going to give me this chart instead without the actual variance in it so I'm going to insert that there so there we are and that's about the variance and that's just those two but even going further than that if I come across to a student examples here um, if you want to show a chart which is charting values that are not um, adjacent not beside each other you can go click and select and I've selected all the students here and if I just want the results I'm going to hold control down and I'm just going to select over the actual results or use the values that I actually want to chart so if I then go insert and recommend the charts and I can choose this one to bring forth the actual results, the overall percentage results. So that's how you easily put charts into an Excel um, spreadsheet. 